welcome to the energy vibration reading for the Taurus Sun Moon and Rising. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is the month of February. The month of February is a fire energy with a zodiac energy of air and water. And in the um, I want to say thank you for your likes, shares, and support. Thank you for your support. And please listen to your sun, moon, and rising sign and the general readings. Okay. Um, it is a month of fire and um, the energies that you have is the energy of the lovers so it's a water energy so it's all about partnerships relationships intimate relationships friendships and business in this month okay so let's move on and go ahead and see what is happening for you Tauruses in this month of February so for you Tauruses let's see in the um, first week you have the energy of the moon so it's going to be a very intuition um, energy some of you could be connecting with soul family okay your soul family and people of past of you know um, karmatic relationships and that sort of a situation so um, this is um, a positive time for you guys especially in the first week first week has the energy vibration of the hair and the energy of this um, um, of fire so you have hair fire and water in this first week in the second week for you Tauruses you have the energy of the swords you're seeing things very very clearly it is as if clarity is here for you for after all those dark periods that you weren't seeing things clearly now you're seeing things very very clearly that is the energy of the hair as we look at the third week let's see what is happening you have the two of cups which is wonderful um, the two of cups with the energy of the lovers is that in the third week a lot of you are going to be connecting with soul family soul mate and um, and a karmatic relationships okay um, the third week is going to be a week where a lot of people are going to be connecting um, you know want to move in together and take your relationship to a higher level or forward in a positive way let's look at the four weeks because you have all four weeks you have the Sun of Pentacles and the Sun of Pentacles in the fourth week could be that a message is coming to you about money or messages coming in um, uh, about um, financial situation maybe you have to pay a bill or something like that or money is coming to you the energy of the hurt so for you Taurus is um, the second uh, the third week and fourth week is going to be a very very positive energies as we look to see what is connecting the first week with the second week we have the energy of the Empress and this is a wonderful energy because it's supporting you Tauruses it's a very very supporting um, energy because the energy of this mother um, of the hurt sign which is the Empress is coming in to let you know that your financial situation will be balanced and it's going to be okay as we look at the connection um, here between the first and second week is that um, via your intuition guidance you are going to get clarity as how you can manifest wealth in your life okay between the first and second week as we look at the second week and the third week to see what is transpiring you have the mother of Pentacles this is very good for the ladies out there and um, whatever situation you're having financial situation um, for your family and um, a money to make sure that your kids are okay and there is food on the table this is going to be a very very positive because you have your own energy vibration with um, you're seeing clearly and you're understanding what is it that you need to do how is it that you're going to be connected it's all about love with the women and their kids um, this can also 
be with the energy of uh, the male influence coming in so it's all about money how you're going to be able to take care of your kids in the second week and third week okay so you have the son of Pentacles for the last week which is going to affect the people between the ages of 18 and 40 the last week is going to affect you guys okay most of all as we look at the second week and the third week connecting with the mother of Pentacles what this is saying is that you have an idea of how you're going to be balancing out your relationship but yet still balancing out uh, um, the relationship of you and your kids and your family and this is going to be wonderful because most of your women uh, and it can be the men over the age of 40 you're going to be thinking or um, let's say the age of 30 you're going to be thinking about uh, the best way um, to support your family okay let's see the connection between third week and the fourth week you have the energy of strength the third week and the fourth week you have the energy of strength and you are going to look within because there is obviously a situation that is happening in your in your family life and especially for the people in between the ages of um, um, 18 to um, 40 you are going to be having a situation that is happening um, with the relationships relationships you're going to look within to find the inner strength to deal with your personal relationships between the um, the third week and the fourth week okay it's all about relationships it's all about um, how to connect because a lot of you um, you're so in love with your partner but you need some time to find the inner strength to deal with certain aspect and certain situation that is going on okay as we look at what is happening um, with the energy of the Empress, Empress and the Mother of Hurt, is that um, you have the energy of the, um, this is the um, Six of Wands, the Six of Wands or the Six of Swords. It looks like swords and it looks like one is a six of swords the six of swords so whatever the situation is um, there is clarity as to how to manifest um, your financial abundancy and uh, your the, the help that you need to survive and you are nearly through a process now you're nearly through this process and I see the mother um, sitting with her child and herself and it's as if uh, the inner guidance and your intuition is very clear things are clear now as how you are to go about uh, doing this and this is going to be extremely wonderful so whatever it is whatever that wasn't clear about how to manifest um, abundance it is now clear and you are holding on to this because you need to make sure that your kids is going to be okay um, in the later years okay as we look forward we are going to look at what is happening with the mother and the kids why she needs to have inner strength and there is a situation that someone is trying to attack um, the mother and the kids and this can be someone between the ages of um, 18 and um, 18 and 40 um, and this is someone who is an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra this is someone who is a, an Aquarius Gemini or a Libra and this situation is now in the reverse for meaning that whoever this person was whatever they were trying to do it has now come to an end is as if the universal angels and guides have guide you so that this situation has um, come to an end okay and the outcomes of this is the ten of burdens and I'm seeing this um, situation happening with the energy of the ten of burdens um, the ten of ones because um, there is an ending to a situation that was transpired with a, a mother and her child it's as if a mother was protecting her child from a situation because there was something that was of injustice and the love between the mother and the child is very 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 important because 
here is the mother and her child and she's seen what has transpired and the love that is between um, the mother and the child is always just so powerful that it doesn't really matter who is coming in because obviously there was someone between the ages of 18 and 40 that was a sick person that tried to get involved and um, and, and get um, between the mother and the child and here you're seeing that the energy of uh, it's coming to an end finally 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 it's coming to an end and the outcomes is the energy of the daughter of Pentacles so um, this is wonderful because um, for the people between the ages especially the women between the ages of um, uh, 18 and 40 you are going to be very 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 strong at this time in your life okay whatever that was transpiring you are going to be extremely strong because you are going to be um, standing up against certain things and a lot of you have karmatic situation with the lovers because also in the fourth week the men will be dealing with the situation because they are in the fourth week that they are dealing with um, a soulmate situation that is a very soulmate relationships are like one of the art artist relationships um, to deal with and, and 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 this is what is happening because there was a situation there was a, a sort of a problem and a situation that was transpiring and it's as if um, you young people are really 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 having um, problems with the energy of the lovers so with your partner with your relationships and most of you men are going to be connecting with your soulmate in the third week and uh, this um, relationship is so intense that you're going to have to um, need and look within for inner strength and guidance okay what I'm seeing here is that the energy of the first week is um, for the general energy is the energy of the tower and the moon comes in so it's as if there wasn't clarity to certain aspects certain things that was happening and the tower came in and break this down so you could be in a relationship that you weren't aware where this relationship is going how this relationship is going to be forming for you what is going to happen in the future and now um, you're seeing clearly because whatever that was blocking your relationship from um, you know moving forward is now in uh, the release and the reverse and now you are seeing that you know this is the relationship that I need to be in as we look at the second week again we are seeing that the second week as the energy of the star and the energy of the star is that you are seeing and that your wishes and dreams are coming true especially with your financial situation because you guys are Tauruses all you need to do is make sure that your financial situation is balanced if nothing else is good your work and financial situation is balanced and now you're really seeing what it is what step do you need to make so that this can happen for you and it is going to be happening in the third week you have the energy of the moon so there is a lot of psychic thing there is a lot of um, it's, so it says the spirit guides are orchestrating that you meet your twin flame or soulmate in this week which is very wonderful and very positive and this is for the men um, ages 18 until 40 this is going to be happening for you guys in the first and in the, the, the third week the two last week of this month is going to be very very positive for you guys so the transformation that is happening the main vocal and the main focus of this month of February for you Taurus is, is the energy of um, the parents and the child the energy of the parents and the child so people 
who do not have children it's going to be you and your inner child that needs to be ill needs to be work on um, you are trying to protect yourself and make sure that you are balancing out your financial situation that at the end of whatever it is going to be working for you and it's going to be working in a very good and positive way so the center and the focus of this month for you guys again it is the parents and child okay the parents and child um, it is a, a month where the soulmate energies come in and this um, energy is very good because um, you're connecting your kids are always uh, um, um, soul family because you came back in this lifetime to protect your kids and also to work out karmatic situation whatever the situation is it's finally coming to an end between what has transpired between you and your child and it's finally coming to an end and this is good for a lot of people the psychic your psychic is going to be very very you're going to be focused on how to materialize your financial abundancy and whatever that has been transpiring with the mother and the child the father and the child the parents and the child it's going to come to an end what is also going to come to an end is uh, um, there was a relationship that some people or it's as if there was a, um, um, you young Tauruses um, and this is going to affect people between the ages of 18 and 40 that you were in a relationship that you had to find inner strength to deal with someone who was uh, and uh, who was an Aries Leo or Sagittarius this could be um, a male or female that you had a relationship with and they did something that was injustice to you and your parents because here it is and um, there it is going up so you know you need to find the inner strength against this person to stand up to this person and um, as you do that this you're going to be seeing a situation that has been working out um, and whatever that has transpired whatever um, that has transpired is as if the energy of the tower is going to come down and break down whatever is happening and the energy of the Sun a positive positive ending is going to happen in this month so whatever situations you have with relationship your intimacy relationship because it's not about work it's all about intimate relationship it can be relationship with yourself for the people who doesn't have kids and for the people who have kids it is relationship with you and your kid it's as if there was someone who comes in as a partner to one of your kids and that sort of a thing and this person has been creating an avoc and um uh, and now and the tower is going to come down and positive energies are going to come out there is so much happening here um, because you are seeing that uh, there was people who were getting involved and now clarity you're finally seeing clarity as to what has transpired and it is now coming to an end in this month uh, whatever that has played with you guys it's, it's it's really you know for a lot of you Tauruses um, your intuitions and guides are going to be coming in and show you the right way of how to manifest your things and whatever that was there the number 10 energy the outcomes of your month the number 10 energy is that all the burdens that you have been carrying all the situation that has been happening is now coming to an end and a new beginning is coming in okay so let's go further and see um, what's happening for you guys this energy comes up also for other for another sign and it is the energy of calling in if you love animals call upon this angel because they are going to be bringing you um, positive energies and I was guided to pick another card for you guys and we have a beautiful this is the rainbow ray whenever I speak about the rainbow ray this is what I'm talking about and you can call upon Archangel Uriel Archangel Michael and uh, Archangel Metatron Archangel Gabriel Archangel Raphael with the angel of Sirifili Paul the Virtuous 
Lord me to Ray, Mother Mary and the Spirit just call them in and ask them to stand in your aura and bring the energy of the rainbow ray in your aura to heal your aura okay this is wonderful this is positive that is a good energy oh my gosh I have been working with um, the unicorns but um, they have either not here right now at this moment so I'm going to use one of my um, I'm going to use the ascendance masters because the unicorns are inside so let's use them um, ascendance masters because we have to um, start using more of the ascendance masters energy, um, energy because this is um, very powerful this is what we have to learn to um, use the energy of the ascendance masters so for you Tauruses in this month of February you have fire so what you do is that um, I invoke fire to lighten my way to the new golden age I invoke fire to light my way to the new golden age I invoke fire to light my way to the new golden age it is so and it is be it is done fire transmute the old energies um, take the new ones to a higher frequency I call upon Archangel Gabriel supervisor of tone the element master of fire fire Solomon and the fire dragons and your guides and angels to transmute the energies of conflicts then spread peace warm and nutrient to people everywhere you can ask the fire element to help you to eat the right foods so that you have the perfect fluid for the ascension journey it will also ignite your aura and keep your chakras and fifth dimension glowing so that you can attract many others on the ascension part isn't this wonderful I'm gonna hold it up here so you guys can come back and read it and do the affirmations it's very very important for you guys to learn to do the affirmation so um, invoke the fire salamanders and the fire dragons and ask them um, to clear your aura and the energy in your house ask them to seal all windows and door in your house that and uh, so that nothing that is not of the Christ light can um, enter okay this is um, very good to do because um, sometimes we have uh, and people bring and send negative energies to us in our houses and that sort of a thing and we seems to be having quarrels and that sort of a thing not knowing what is happening and this is what is happening so let's move forward and see what other energies is coming out for you Tauruses and the solar plex chakra this is good because another sign also got it the frequency of the solar plex chakra is yellow so yellow is going to be your color for this month the yellow is going to be your color for this month um, the flower of life supports our sense of uh, our personal power and willpower as um, well as knowing of who we are and what uh, contributions is uh, to be old and this is wonderful this is positive whatever the situation is whatever has transpired you need to um, go within and find this um, your power so call up an Archangel Uriel and all the angels of the solar plex chakra to touch open and activate your shoulder plex chakra you can also call upon Archangel um, Archangel um, um, Metatron because he is always always there for you guys okay so I want to say to each and every person please remember to listen to your Sun moon and rising sign um, this is an positive positive energy that can help you um, to go forward in this month whatever the situation is whatever that has transpired this is going to be ill namaste until next week Thank you.